My name is Wei Xu. Uh, I'm an assistant professor of mechanical engineering at Rowan University. I'm working with uh, Professor Xiao Hu and Professor Jeffrey Hedinger from physics. Together, we are developing a wearable sensor system that can be attached to the human skin to measure the heart rate, not only the pulse rate. For pulse rate, you're getting a number basically the number of beats per minute. Measuring the heart rate is better because we can get the actual ECG signal, the heart rhythm, beat by beat in real time. When you show the diagram to a physician, they can really look at the heartbeat condition and uh, see what's going right and what's going wrong with the patient. Doctors measure the heart rhythm now by using electrodes. They basically set up up to 12 electrodes on the human body, and the patient has to sit on the uh, hospital bed. It's gonna be a flexible, a lightweight, and small device. It can be attached to the human skin. It's gonna be communicated through Bluetooth, so it's a wireless device. Right now, our current generation is about a one inch by three inches, but we are considering a new design, basically at least to cut the size in half, or even to one third of the original design. The particular notable feature of our device, I think it's actually the silk material being used. It replaces the synthetic polymers used in many wearable bands, wearable watches. We chose silk because it's mobile compatible, and it doesn't really cause irritation from many synthetics. So the Rowan Office of Research help us connect it to a medical doctor who give us a good idea where the project should go. They send us uh, with the right team, help us file the uh, provisional patent application, and then one year later they help us file the uh, formal patent application. They handled all the documentation from start to the end. They also provided a letter of support showing the importance of this project. That letter helped us obtain a $50,000 grant from the New Jersey Health Foundation. In terms of the patch application, we are thinking even the athletes, they can use this for training because they can monitor their heart rhythm in real time and continuously. Also with some of the amateurs, they want to check on their workouts and their condition throughout the day. We are actually thinking expanding the project to target different problems, especially for physicians uh, working with heart diseases with the patients.